We're boiling the foxtail noodles till they get soft. A simple way of testing it, pick a small piece, bite it. If you have a bite, that means it's still a little to be cooked. So we strain the noodles. We strain the noodles. Isco. Wash it with cold water and cool. So I'm doing one masala noodle and one is a regular noodle. Using millet bank, cold pressed white sesame oil. So we add a little bit of sesame oil. And in the cold noodles, which have been cold, add a little bit of the masala mix which is brought in the packet itself. Okay, we keep this and rest we keep it here. Now we toss it up. This will help to have the masala going right into the noodles and you can have a tasty noodles. Next we are just blanching the hard vegetables like carrots and we strain them. Then, now we put the pan. Now we again use a millet bank, white sesame oil. It's a cold press oil, got nice strong flavor and so you don't need to use too much of it. A little bit of it. You can even use millet bank granite oil if you don't like a strong flavor of the sesame. Sesame flavor goes very well. This. Allow them to crackle. So now you can see they're slowly crackling up. Now is the time to add a little bit of curry leaves. Little onions. Next, add the vegetables, boil vegetables, green chili and ginger, the garlic, the spices up a little bit. The salt. The remaining magic masala which we got it from the millet bank packet. So this is the masala. There is a nice strong aroma. And here now you add your millet bank noodles the healthy foxtail noodles and now mix two minute noodles which are healthy tasty and quick to make i'll give you a little trick how to put it yeah Pick up. 
you a nice fresh sprig of coriander to add to the flavor so here you have millet bank foxtail millet noodles so tasty would like to taste no you say okay